we got some things to talk about. Jacks boy, Jacks boy, Jacks boy. I'm talking about them Jacks boy, Jacks boy, Jacks boy. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, and I'm back with another video. In the words of my boy, Ball Head, what it do? Jack. Yo, this your boy, Jack Ball Trades. Yeah, man, we we chilling today, baby. We at home. Can't go to the rain because for the past couple of days, maybe the whole week, man, it's been raining, man, like crazy. You know, I started to go commando style, just run out there, get in the rain, get some good training in, pop, 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 pop slide in the mud, you know what I'm saying? But that wouldn't be a safe thing to do because I don't want to injure nobody, you know what I'm saying? So, hey, before we get deeper into the video, hey, um, I have an event. Oh, I have an event going on August the 16th. Bring your toys out too. And with that event, the details of that event is pretty much we help trying to raise money to give away to people that's in need, all right? I don't have no money, but I have a little resource, okay? And if you'd like to donate to the channel, please send me an email. I'll put all that in the description below. Follow me on Instagram. Uh, shoot me a DM. I'll put my cash app in there. I'm not looking for much. It's just, I'm just looking for a little something to keep these videos coming. All right, I'm trying not to make this video long because we have an unboxing to do. We got an unboxing to do. But before we get into the unboxing, let me finish telling you about the event. So I have a good buddy. He, he battled stage four cancer, right? And also I will put his GoFundMe in the description below. And if you, um, it would be greatly appreciated if you could donate to his GoFundMe. All right. Well, with that being said, August the 16th, Bring the Toys Out, part two. It's going to be a dope event. We got a lot of people that's supposed to be coming. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I just appreciate the people that have been reaching out to me saying, hey, we come to your event. Some of them went to the first event where we had like 60 people, bro. Can you believe that? Little old me, little old town had 60 people, and I'm very grateful for that. So this year, let's double that, all right? Let's get 120. You know, the range we're going to be at is going to be... In Camp Mississippi, it's going to be on the flyer. All that's going to be in this video somewhere in the description below. All right, I didn't waste two minutes yapping. So let's get into the unboxing. Now, this unboxing that we're doing is just quick unboxing um, to show the company that, yo, I'm rocking with y'all. I'm going to show you product. Then when it start raining, then we're going to go into full force detail testing and evaluation, baby. All right? So that being said, hold one. Yeah, I know I'm not in my um, room the normal room that I be in because guess what? It's been built as a gun safe, a gun vault. All right, so we doing a lot of work inside. So shout out to Lock Lockdown for sending me out products so we can show to you guys. But just be patient with me. We gotta get the we gotta get some more panels. We gotta get the doors up. Yo, it's gonna be dope, man. I'm excited. Hey, shout out to Lockdown. I'm put that information in the script in the description below too. And with that being said, let's get this unboxing done, baby. Woo! Oh, 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 oh. Hey, guys, I'm back. My bad, my bad. Hey, I know the display kind of different. I'm in the living room. You see some of my, my stuff, trophies and stuff like that, you know. All right, this packet here is from Vector Optics. Let's open this bad boy. Shout out to you, Vector. For sending me out this optic. Like I said, it's just a quick unboxing. There we go. Get it out the way. Okay. Constantine. One by 10 by 24. Okay. Let's open it there. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going? All right. Tripping. All right. Hey. Got some little stuff. Get that out of the way. 
Of course, you need a, a lens cleaner. Always. Ooh, the user manual. Now, let's see what we have here. Wow. So you don't know the Constantine is there on an LPBO. Uh, like I said, another video, we're gonna get deep into details. All right, all right, all right. I love your, your little handle for your magnific magnification. Let's look, see how clear this glass is. Like I said, okay. So, got another um, cap so you can lock down your degrees, whatever you want to call it. Lock down your stuff. Out the way. Oh, dope, dope, dope. So, it comes with its own rain mounts, right? Uh, it's not the LPVO um, rain mount that I'm looking for. Well, is that a such thing? LPVO rain mount? But well, anyway, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, matter of fact, I'll show you what I'm talking about. But still, it's got the um the scope these the, these scope range right. But let's let's look at this glass, baby. This glass is clear. And another thing about it is, with the scope, it's got like the basic um, crosshairs in it, but it have a red dot in it. Like I said, I haven't dove into this scope a whole lot, so when I get ready to take it to the range. We're gonna go with everything that need to be known about this scope. Just a quick unboxing, you know. Put it out there. This glass is clear. I'm on. I'm be able to tell you what kind of glass and everything it is. Hey, don't beat me up, man. I haven't had much time to do my research, study it. You know, I want. I, you know, I want to be. I want to get them a fair review, and I'm. And you know, I'm. I'm honest as I can be when it comes to stuff like that. But really, what I'm trying to figure out. What to put it on? Hmm. I might put it on the jackal. Y'all give me your opinion. Hold on, let me see. What I'm talking about. Ugh. LPVO mounts, which that's not the correct term to call it. So don't beat me up too bad in the comments. But scope mount like this. I'm gonna probably end up purchasing that like later, unless there's a um, scope company out there looking at this. Hey. Will you send me one out? If not, that's okay. I'm not mad. I can purchase mine. I've been doing it for the longest. All right, but no. Should I should I put it on the jackal? Yeah, I get what you're saying. What's wrong with the ACOG on the jackal? Well, my only complaint is with the ACOG on the jackal, uh, my eye relief. So, you know, I have to... So, but I got something planned for this. All right, I'm building another battle rifle, so it might go in there. But I think the LPVO would be better on the Jackal. Then I'm gonna mess around. And pretty much, it's gonna be kind of set up like my AR-15. LPVO, red dot, you know, CQB type stuff. But, so this is too big, it's too long, it's 16 inches. I mean, you can use anything, but I'd rather use something shorter. Um, that's what I'm building a battle rifle to be shorter than what I got. But here, the Jackal, yeah, um, I might put it on here. I think it would be a great fit for the Jackal in case something else come up. You know it's gun guy. We can't never be satisfied with what we're running. We just got to get that purpose set up so we can go to the range train. All right, real quick, I'm going to uh, change this out. Let me put the LPVO here uh, and give you a good idea what it look like. All right, hold on one second. So what'd you think? Yeah, it got a girl on me. But I ain't gonna lie. I'm, I'm loving the glass and it's clear as day. So, um, probably what I end up changing instead of making this a uh, Instead of having a two-piece mount, I'm gonna just get that one piece, like what's on my rifle, my rifle here. I don't know, kind of sleek, ain't it? Um, yeah. Hey, tell me what you think in the comment section. Um, it will be another video coming, man. It's 
right now it's too plain. I got to dig this thing out. I got to put some lights or something on it. Um, hey, give me a few pointers in the comment section. So, you think I should have, give me your opinion now. Honest opinion. You think I should have stuck with that ACOG or the scope? I think the scope is better. Yeah. Until next video, man. Hey, y'all, please be safe. Please be blessed. And it's your boy, Jack of All Trades. I'm